Okay, well, hey guys, I'm going to talk about something today, and today I'm talking about the Ohio school shooting. Uh, basically, there was a school in Ohio, and people, hey guys, started shooting. Shocker! Now, one person, unfortunately, was uh, pronounced dead. Pronounced, is that what you... Yeah, he was, he was pronounced dead. Yeah, that's right. And four others at the time have been noted to be wounded. Uh, let's talk about the reason the dude started shooting people. We don't know for sure, but we think he was being bullied. Now, let me say this about that situation. I know school shootings have been happening a lot recently, and people are saying, stop bullying, stop bullying. You gotta stop it. People, that kid, he was bullied. You know, it's the kid's fault. It's the other kid's fault for bullying him in the first place. No, stop that. Stop. Don't give this dude a scapegoat because he was bullied, all right? Bullying has been happening since the beginning of time. Even in like 1901, you know, kids would be in school like, hey kid, I'm gonna sock you right in your mouth. Why would you do that? Your mom only has one farm and my dad has two. <laughs> Like I don't know I don't know what the situation was. I'm I'm not really good with recounting historical American events. But I do know that every couple months a kid did not go to school and shoot up the school or take a pitchfork to the school or set the school on fire or do that. That was not an epidemic because you know that was not it just wasn't, okay? We are at a time where these kids have access to guns, these kids have access to the internet where they see other kids shoot up schools. We gotta stop, we gotta get, if you know your kid is crazy, then send him to a mental hospital, okay? Like, sometimes you don't even know. Like, okay, I can understand that, but jeez, like, this is not completely the fault of bullying. I agree, I'm against bullying, I don't, I don't believe that people should be bullied to the point where they break down, that's horrible, but, gosh, please don't try to use that as a scapegoat for what the what these dudes are doing here. Nobody in their right mind would bring a gun to school and start shooting people. In a way, all I can say is it's kind of like it takes willpower. Some people don't have willpower. And technically I believe that anybody can build willpower up. If you're being bullied, who cares? Like if somebody says something to you, who cares? If somebody actually touches you, then tell somebody. Tell somebody if somebody's like pushing you around or stuff, tell somebody. If somebody's talking to you and they just keep talking, if it gets annoying to the point where you don't want to deal with it, tell somebody. That's all you got to do. Tell somebody. You guys are just taking this way out of control with shooting people. Stop shooting people. That's a waste of bullets. It's a waste of police resources when you could just waste the counselor's time all day by telling them your problems. Like That's all you got to do. Stop shooting people. But in other news, uh, surviving high school tips. That's kind of ironic. God, that, I didn't. I shouldn't have made that joke. Surviving high school should be up tomorrow if I can finish this project up soon. So we will see about that. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay valiant. Joseph here. Joseph is now leaving. Bye bye.